So we check example number two. Uh, log of 625 minus a third, log of 125, log of 5, then divide by log of 125 minus 2 over 3, log 5, plus 1 over 3, uh, the log of 25. Now, again, uh, using the second method, these numbers again are related to the base of 5. So we can uh, simplify the numbers into base of 5, so solution. So we're writing this the same as log of 5 to this word, add power 4 minus 1 over 3 log 125 is the same as 5 to power what? To power 3, then plus log of what? Log of 5, then divide by log of 5 again to power what? To power 3 minus 2 over 3 the log of 5, then plus 1 over 3, the log of 5 words, 5 squared. Then we know the log of our logarithm that involves the powers. So we have a power, you drop the power, you can drop the power, and so on and so forth. So, we don't give those words. So 4, log of words, log of 5, minus. Now you drop. 3 here, and you have a third, they will cancel out that. Eh? So you have minus 1, so minus. You don't really need to write the 1, you just remain log of what? Log of 5, then plus the log of 5. So that is the numerator. Then the denominator, drop uh, the power, so 3, log of what? Log of 5. So you drop 3. So this one remains the same way it is, so 2 over 3, log of 5, then plus, uh, these are 2, so drop it, we have 2 over 3, the log of 5. So you can see, we have uh, simplified everything to be a log of a number 5. We have simplified everything to be a number of a uh, 5. Therefore, now since all of them, now you can always take this as a term. You can say, you can assume it's a, like a term, like uh, 4x minus x plus x. Take this as a term uh, because it is one and the same thing. So it is 4 minus 1 plus 1. So minus 1 plus 1, first of all, becomes a 0. So in the numerator, we remain 4 log of what? Log of 5. Then come to the denominator 3 log of 5 minus 2 over 3 log 5 plus 2 over 3. So minus 2 over 3 plus 2 over 3, that is 0. This and this become 0, so you made 3. The log of what? The log of 5. So therefore, in short, uh, this and this are the same thing. So you made what? 4 over 3 as the solution. So Application in logarithms can be this simple as long as you really understand how to use uh, the laws uh, of logarithm. So that's it. So we check the last example and um, uh, from there uh, we check the last example then we shall check how to change uh, base when it comes to operation of logarithms. So example.